It's Luke W coming back at you again today with another video. I just upgraded my Helium 10 Platinum plan to the Diamond plan where I'm now able to experiment with our new PPC automation tool. We're gonna go hop right behind my computer. I'm gonna show you how it works. And honestly, I've never seen another tool like this out there on the market, so I'm really excited. I just took my first glance at it today and there's so many features. I'm definitely gonna make a follow-up video to this one, but let's jump behind my computer and check it out right now. So we are on the Helium 10 suite, their entire dashboard that has every one of their tools. And if you're gonna be an Amazon seller and taking this stuff seriously, I highly recommend you do look into getting a software just like Helium 10. I used to be a big fan of Jungle Scout, but when I noticed their price increase, especially for their Chrome extension, which used to just be a one-time offer of $97 for life, and now it's like 40 bucks a month. When I went over to Helium 10, their Chrome extension was free for the first 50 uses a month, and it helped people learn the benefit of being able to see the value of how many sales certain products are making and, and judging whether a product had good demand and low competition. And it was just a great way for people to learn this stuff without having to put too much money up front. So that's why I made the switch over to Helium 10 and I actually revamped my entire Amazon course to encompass everything having to do with Helium 10. So here we are now, they're on the cutting edge of all their upgrades that they've been doing and they're constantly improving upon their tools from everything from product research to your keyword research, listing optimization. And since I got a new product that's starting to really take off, I've actually noticed I've been getting a few more hijackers. So using this alerts method lets me know exactly when someone's jumping on my listing and I can immediately get them taken off because I'm brand registered. But that's a whole topic for another day. One one other note I want to make is I've been super stoked as well on their follow-up platform and from here you can create your own email templates which I've been using to get I almost have 70 reviews on one of my new products right now email automations and follow-ups and that's been really helping to get my reviews up and honestly when you think about the money that your products are making from these reviews and from other things that you use in this tool it well easily pays for itself even when the platinum plan is actually $97 a month now, another cool tip is if you use my link right down below and you type in Luke 50 and apply this, you're gonna be able to get 50% off your first month or you can say Luke 10 and get 10% off every month if you wanna do that. And I've even done a couple of interviews with the Helium 10 staff and they are on par. They don't mind if you ask for a refund even if you're 28 days into that one month of using your tools. But like I said, this stuff really does come in handy. Now in this video, we're gonna to have to be using the Diamond Plan which you can see is gonna give us access to the automated PPC management tool which is brand new and they're only gonna keep optimizing this over time. So if I pop in right there, we can see the dashboard, which lays out so much more information than actually my Seller Central account's gonna give me. Now, Seller Central, you're gonna have to pull your ad reports. You're gonna have to see what keywords are doing all the good job for you. With this tool, you can come over to the analytics tab and see how each of your campaigns is running on the campaign level, which we have here. But you can also go down to the keyword level and even the search term level. So this takes all that busy work out of having to download that Excel spreadsheet, pulling it in and using a pivot table to see all your keywords. This does all that for you and gives you all the best data on what you need to see for your keywords right within here. And you can see there's 1115 entries of keywords that I can go through and see which keywords are performing the best for me. Now, if I come up here, you'll see there's this little button that says learn. You can click on that on any of the tabs, even if I go back to the dashboard and press on learn, which is gonna give you an in-depth look at all their tools and how everything works from the suggestions that it gives you. And this is actually insane where it's gonna anticipate what keywords are gonna be the best for you to start ranking and making sales with your products. And if we come over here to suggestions, you can actually set a target ACoS and start making the Helium 10 software automate to meet your demands of what you want for your products. So you can come in here and it will say a couple suggestions for you like, hey, with this keyword bid, I'm hiding all the keywords to the left side of this page here, but it's saying, hey, if you increase this by two cents, this may give you quite a bit more exposure based on our search results. Now, I have this and I kind of just started it. So after the Helium 10 algorithm has time to look at your products and see how everything's doing, it's gonna give you better and better suggestions. I literally just downloaded this today and I think there's only one other video on it on YouTube right now. They just launched the beta of this, so it's pretty crazy. But I can just say, hey, yes, I'll go ahead and apply a two cent increase to this keyword and I can do it as simple as that. And when you have a campaign that's working really well for you, you can actually start to automate it to just allow the suggestions to automatically take place if it's already performing well. And that's just gonna help save you so much time in the long run of having to look in your campaigns, see what keywords are working for you. Instead of wasting time doing that, you can start doing more product research or focusing on just generating more income instead of all this little side work. Honestly, there's not too much time I even put into my Amazon business besides product research and doing what I do best in that 
that area. Now, when it comes to PPC, this is just like hiring a PPC expert. If you're pretty well versed in PPC already, you'll be able to anticipate the changes that you wanna make to your account and start getting the progress you want on your products. Like if I go into my own Amazon account here, I've zoomed into some of my campaigns and you can see I do really low budgets. I'm all about having a really low ACoS and you can see my ACoS here on an average for all the campaigns year to date right now is only 5.29%. Now a lot of people might be like, holy crap, Luke, like a 10% ACoS is extremely low. And yeah, I'm really kind of picky on the keywords I'm doing and I've discovered that doing a really low bid strategy has actually helped me so much. You see, I've spent $800 to make $15,000 in advertising. Now, if I come back to the dashboard here, I can see that the PPC spend isn't exactly the year to date right now because it is August 31st. And I only have this going till August 28th. For some reason, it's not giving us the amount of data that I need to see up to live time up to this day. And when I watched the Helium 10 podcast on this, they said something like Amazon actually needs three days to even catch up to give you accurate numbers on all your campaigns. So Helium 10 is already anticipating that and just not allowing you to see the results and until they're really caught up in Amazon in real time. Now, the cool thing that I wanted to show you is that there's a new data point that I've never seen ever before. And this is called the tacos, the total ACoS. And that's gonna be your total PPC spend divided by your total combined organic and advertised sales. So normally in Amazon, it's just gonna say your ACoS here, 5.67%. Now that's gonna be the percentage of my PPC spend on into my PPC sales. Now the total ACoS is gonna divide my PPC spend by my total organic sales. That's 0.65%. That's so crazy to see that this is such a small amount that I'm actually paying for my advertising because $742 in PPC spend has led to $114,000 in sales. That just shows you that I'm making mostly a lot of my sales organically and my PPC spend is just supplementing that, helping to rank my products. And there's so much more you can dive into here to see what keywords you're starting to make a lot of sales under and then you're gonna start ranking for those keywords. Now this is not a tool that you're gonna to wanna to use to just straight up launch your products. Like I said, Helium 10's algorithm takes a little bit of time to see what your campaigns are doing and over time, it's gonna start allowing you to make automations, which I'll show you in a bit. I'm just hiding all my PPC campaigns over here on the left-hand side. It will allow me to make the decision whether I wanna automate that campaign, which is gonna allow Helium 10's algorithm to automatically change the bids of my campaigns up or down a little bit to optimize them over time. It's even gonna add negative keywords into my campaigns if they're not performing well. And there's different rules that you can set up. Like if we've spent $10 on one keyword and we haven't made any sales, the rule can automatically say then just move that to a negative keyword if you want it to do that. So this will automatically fine tune your campaigns over time that could lead to just insane amounts of sales. And that's one of the reasons I haven't put so much time into PPC besides just making an extra 14K in revenue on $800 in spend. It's just because I haven't really wanted to dive into the time that it takes to do this. And honestly, my organic sales are really great. And the ways I do launches allows me to get up to page one pretty quickly with things like the Helium 10 two-step URL, which is for free. If you just type in Helium 10 gems, you can create a special URL, get a couple people to buy your product from that special URL, which will start ranking you for your keyword that you wanna rank for. There's just so much that the Helium 10 platform offers and that gems tool is completely free by the way. But I wanna quickly go in and actually just add a campaign and show you exactly how all this works right here. So it's kind of similar to how Amazon has it. You just need to put in a campaign. So I'm just gonna say test here, and then you're gonna enter in a SKU, and you can simply find that right in your manage inventory tab. It says the SKU. You just copy and paste that right in here. And then what Helium 10 does is it actually filters down with a really unique strategy. It's really cool. They start with an automatic campaign, a research campaign, and then a proving campaign. So it's gonna start gathering a bunch of unique keywords for your product with this automatic campaign. Then it's gonna narrow it down to a broad match campaign and then to an exact match campaign where you're then gonna be left with just the best keywords for your product and you're gonna start spending the smallest amount to be making the most amount of sales. It just narrows everything down right for you right in here. You can come in and set your budget, your target ACoS and your default bid for the auto research and proving campaigns right down here. I usually like to use phrase match inside of my campaigns, but with this tool, I've already created a campaign earlier today and I'm gonna just go with what they say is suggested and just do the broad match and see how that performs for me. I usually have better luck with phrase match campaigns, but I'm just gonna test this one out. 
but then you can come down and add your rules right in here. Like I said, you can say, if a keyword has spent $10 and hasn't made any sales, I wanna go ahead and move that keyword to a negative keyword so I stop wasting money. Another cool thing they have here is this threshold number of sales. And I watched another video and they said, you should put it at three here. So that means it's gonna move your keywords to these next campaigns and to these proven campaigns after you've actually made three sales from maybe a broad match type keyword. And after it's hit three sales from that keyword, it knows it's proven and we're gonna move it into the exact match campaign. They even have a threshold number of clicks. When you set up your rules, you can say, if I've had 25 clicks and no sales, we're gonna move that to a negative keyword match campaign or something like that. And even the threshold cost where I can say, hey, if we've passed over $10 for a keyword, I'm gonna throw that right into a negative match. I don't wanna keep wasting money for that campaign. So honestly, this is just a brief overview of this tool. You can see how powerful it is. I really hope you do. And if you did like this video, please drop a thumbs up and you know share it with some friends. I mean, honestly, Helium 10 is blowing things out of the water right now. I know Jungle Scout and Helium 10 have kind of been the two big tools on the market, but I just can't deny that Helium 10 offers kind of the higher quality tool at a lower price for you guys. So again, I'll have that discount code linked right down below and you can click that link and follow right on in. And there's free tutorials all over the Helium 10 podcast and their YouTube channel. And if you come in here, they have so much more. You can see your daily profits and they even have this freedom ticket course where I've watched about 60% of this and it's gonna take you through what they call a thousand dollar course pretty much on setting up your business. And they have the guy, Kevin Kink, Okay, maybe I haven't finished 60%, looks like only 28% complete, but this is a really long course. Like the course I provide is only 10 hours long. It's cut and dry, straight to the point. All you need to know to get everything up and running. But think about it, if you get the platinum plan or what you need for this PPC tool, the diamond plan, you're gonna be able to get this extra freedom ticket course and you can play these videos when you're on your way to work or whatever on the, your last few days you ever have to sign in that nine to five. But honestly, just having this extra bit of info and, and this course accessible for you guys with the Helium 10 platform, you're gonna be able to use all the info they're giving you here and apply that to your actual Helium 10 tools. So I think, you know, if you get a mentor, something like what I'm providing, plus the Helium 10 tool, where you can actually get this program as well, you guys have no real way that you can possibly lose. Like with Amazon itself, it's already so data-driven that you're gonna be able to see the profit margin you're getting before you ever buy product. And then when you get that product, you see the threshold of, hey, I can get this thing for 10 bucks. Worst case scenario, I can sell it for 20. Best case scenario, I'm selling it at 45. Like at least I'm gonna be breaking even, making all my money back. That's why I tell people, hey, just start with 100 units to test this product market. That might cost you, you know, $1,000 to start. So it's not too big of a startup cost to build something that can really scale into something huge. Like one of my recent student successes, Brian Pate, any of you guys been watching the channel, you know he's pulled 14K in a day. He has a listing that does $200,000 a month. And like I said, it's August 31st right now and he got my course uh, in mid-March or something like that. So people are blowing this stuff out of the water. I highly recommend you look into this and the world is your oyster, guys. Go out, hop into it, and we will see you later. Peace out.